Welcome to the 8th day of the Joey Gaming 12 Days of Christmas. Today, I have kind of a Christmas story. It involves snow, but I don't know if this really took place around Christmas time. It happened a long time ago. Uh, I would say back in 2016, I, this happened, but I'm not completely sure. But anyways, guys, make sure you check out my full playlist, playlist on the Joy Gaming 12 Days of Christmas. Because I have a lot planned for this series. And we're already, like, almost done with it. So if you can check it out, that would be amazing, alright? If you haven't yet, please check it out. I also have two other amazing story times. One is about my Christmas nightmare, which was really strange you should check that out and my other one is about the time i was peeking into christmas presents oh yes oh yes that was a pretty good one um but that i believe that one's like day 10 so you guys have to wait two days i don't know what damn we're uploading this video i'm not really paying attention but let's let's just start the uh let's just start the video okay so when i was like younger i always wanted a snowmobile with my dad my dad and his group of friends were big snowmobilers, okay, and they had these awesome machines, all right. They were they were pretty good at it, all right. Like they knew all the tricks in the book. Um, they're not too crazy. You're not gonna see my dad and his and his buddies ramp snowmobiles. No, that wasn't that wasn't him, all right. But he can climb. But he climbs like steep. He climb. He climbs like very steep mountains and I live in Idaho so I have these mountains everywhere in in Idaho so yeah so we my dad would do that I always asked if I can go and when I do go I always ride with him I don't ever drive but one year my dad says you know what Joey you're old enough so you can drive so he gave me my grandma's snowmobile when he I don't know it's like some 1980 snowmobile so I rode that and uh, it was pretty awesome at first I wasn't that good I was really slow because I didn't want to go super fast but eventually I warmed up. I kept driving for a while. I ran off this road sometimes. I got stuck sometimes because I was new and my snowmobile was not made for it. And I was super light. Keep in mind this was back in 2016. I was like 12 years old. 12, 13 years old. So I wasn't that, um, I wasn't that big of a kid at the time. So I was still pretty light and all that stuff. So I would drive around, do all that stuff. Um, and my dad told me that he wanted me to climb this one hill and the hill wasn't that steep and I went up it and the first time I went up it wasn't that bad but on the way down it got way steeper and it went really fast and I ended up ramping the thing it was pretty crazy and my dad said that he was pretty scared and proud that I was able to do that meanwhile I'm like terrified but my dad was pretty proud of me so yeah we move on okay so we drive around in this big forest, all right, and my dad um, was telling our buddies to that they're gonna that he was gonna take us to this wide open area up in the mountain. So we reach this wide open area up in the mountain, and I start driving around, and I stopped. I started breaking away from my team, from my group, and I started doing my own thing. Uh, my mindset is I wasn't gonna follow any tracks, and I was gonna go around all these places all right so i started driving around and all this crazy stuff going as fast as i can because there's no trees like how am i gonna am i gonna hit an invisible tree no i'm not gonna hit an invisible tree so i drive around all over the place in this big open area going as fast as possible going fast and furious and all but you know my snowmobile is not old it was kind of old so it wasn't going that fast it probably got up to like 30 to 40 miles per hour to be honest with you so I was doing that. Actually, actually, I think I have video of it. Um, I'll show some video of me on that snowmobile. So this is the snowmobile uh, when I was younger. Of course, I was a little older in that clip, but yeah. So just picture me two years younger in that video, and then that's me. All right, that's the snowmobile. So I was driving around in this huge open area. All right, and eventually I spat across. All right, and then suddenly I felt this drop. And I dropped down and I see water and it crashed right into this creek and it was up to my I think I have a picture a Facebook picture I'll post that right now also follow me on my Facebook page uh, I post announcements there like once a month if I had more engagement I probably would paste post up there more but you know I don't get engagement so change that please but yeah so, so I crashed into this creek and it's like holy crap what did I do and I was worried that I ruined the snowmobile and then I got up the hill and I flagged my 
dad and his teammates down. And they started coming over and they said, Joey, what did you do? It's like, I don't know, I was driving around and I fell into this creek. Alright? Meanwhile, my dad thinks it was the most hilarious thing ever. Alright? Um, the, the water was kind of deep. It was probably like 5 to 10 feet deep. This whole snowmobile wasn't emerged on the on the looks of things, but I crashed into this creek, this little river, all right? And my dad told me, saying, hey, Joey, don't follow tracks like that, especially at high speeds, because that could have been like a cliff or you can cause like an avalanche or something. I don't know. But he told me not to do that or I might end up in a creek like this. So it took me a little bit. At first, I couldn't get it out. Eventually, they had a pull with the snowmobiles. They had to get their own snowmobiles. They had to pull to get that thing out, which was very successful. And uh, yeah, so that was kind of that whole experience done. Uh, 10 out of 10 won't recommend doing that. At first, it was fun, but I was kind of scared the crap out of me. Luckily, the snowmobile still worked, even though it was kind of submerged underwater a little bit. But yeah, it was pretty crazy, and I, honestly, that was pretty fun. That was my kind of my first experience being on a snowmobile like that. And I honestly don't know how I would, honestly, it's been a pretty crazy uh, story time I told you there, alright? If you ended up enjoying this video, please share the love, and by clicking subscribe and leaving in a comment. But anyways, guys, thanks for watching, like, and subscribe, and see ya. Peace.